They just see me being this desperate chick, you know, with no confidence. And but nobody's seeing like he led me on. Totally. Kim and Usman seemed pretty happy together, but then everything came crashing down around them in the latest episode when they got into a massive fight, and it really looked like they might be over for good, but then Kim revealed something shocking about their relationship on her Instagram, and you'll never believe what it was. Kim and Usman always seemed to be running into problems in their relationship, and during the latest episode, they actually got into a huge blow-up fight that left everyone wondering about the state of their relationship, and it started started out as a pretty important and serious discussion about their future, but it soon developed into an intense argument and it got so bad that Kim actually threw a drink right in Usman's face and then stormed off, and Kim and Usman are both from completely different cultures and it's been causing friction between them and their families, and in Usman's culture, apparently his mom actually needs to approve of Kim before the two can get married, and that's actually the reason why Kim flew to Nigeria to see Usman this time, and you know, she was going to meet meet his family and hopefully secure the approval of Usman's mother so that they could actually get engaged and Kim was really hoping to get Usman's mom on her side and she actually flew there hoping to propose to Usman as soon as possible so that they could apply for the U.S. visa and you'll need the visa before you can come to the U.S. to see Kim's family and Kim's son Jamal actually hasn't even met Usman yet because he hasn't been able to come to America since he and Kim met. And it's pretty important to Kim that they get to meet soon. I mean, we've seen on the show that her family is actually pretty skeptical of the relationship, at least they were when the show was being filmed, and a lot has happened since then. I mean, Kim's mom sadly passed away in January before she was able to meet Usman in person, and they did at least meet over a video call that Usman posted a recording of when the sad news was announced. And from the recording, Kim's mom and Usman actually seemed to get along pretty well. And in the episode, Kim's mom actually said that she only wanted Kim to be happy, and she was worried Kim and Usman's relationship might be one-sided, but that seemed to be her only issue, you know, with the whole thing. And Kim has actually shared a post on her Instagram saying that this episode would be hard to watch for her because it's the one with her mom in it, and she apparently really misses her mom. And the two of them were very close, and you can clearly see that, you know, in their interactions on the show. But not everyone seems to be as happy with Kim and Usman's relationship. Jamal seemed to be a lot more critical than Kim's mom. And in a confession, he shared that he didn't really trust Usman, and he suspected that Usman might just be using Kim to get a U.S. visa, and it really looks like Jamal doesn't have much faith in Kim and Usman's relationship, and that's probably the biggest reason why Kim really needs Usman to come to the U.S. so that Jamal can meet him and hopefully feel better about the relationship, but Kim and Usman first need to get engaged before Usman can apply for a visa, and so Kim did fly to Nigeria to get approval of Usman's mom to discuss the specific conditions of the engagement, but getting the mom's approval turned out to not be as big as problem. They have much bigger issues to deal with, and it's actually because of the pretty big age difference between them, and Kim already has an adult son, and she isn't going to be having any more kids, but Usman wants to have his own kids, so the plan is for them to apparently get a second wife who can, you know, actually have the babies with, and that's really what the whole blow-up was about. Usman and Kim were discussing their relationship with Usman friend KB and KB was talking about how he's married to two women and has nine kids and it was actually the plan already that Usman would get a second wife too so that he could have kids and you know Kim agreed to this before although she had a couple of conditions and she said she would be okay with Usman having a second wife as long as she never had to meet her or the children but KB was telling them about how good it is that his two wives are friends and I guess Usman was a little inspired by that because he suggested that maybe he could bring the future kids he'd have with his second wife into his life with Kim in America, and that's something that Kim was strongly against. So she, you know, was understandably upset by the suggestion, but it got even worse than that because Usman also suggested that maybe he could have not one, but three other wives, and it actually sounded like he was mainly interested in more wives so that he could have more kids faster. And he actually did a quick calculation and figured out that with three wives, he could have 10 children in about three years if he got lucky, and it looked like he thought Kim would be happy about this because in his own words, then they would be done 
but that suggestion actually really upset Kim, and I don't know what you know Usman was thinking because it's not like you're just done having kids after they're born. Kim actually got really bad at Usman saying that she only agreed to one extra wife, and even that was a lot for her. And even though she had previously agreed to Usman, you know, could get a second wife from this conversation, it looked like maybe she had never been entirely okay with that. So obviously, Usman suggesting, you know, he could have even more wives is very upsetting to her. And Usman actually noticed this and started questioning if Kim would really be happy with him having a second wife in the first place. And the conversation got heated pretty quickly. And after that, until Kim just couldn't take it anymore and she stormed off in the middle of the conversation but before that she actually threw a milkshake in Usman's face and she just seemed really mad and she actually wasn't the only one. You know, Usman shared in a confessional that he felt pretty disrespected by Kim, and it also turned out that Kim was actually not planning to stick around, and so she stormed off, and she said she was going to book a plane ticket home, and now we're all left wondering what's happened in their relationship, and I mean, it really looks like this might be the end for them, and Kim even said beforehand that she would either get engaged to Usman on this trip to Nigeria, or leave heartbroken with their relationship over, and we've seen her literally about to book a ticket home, but we don't don't know for sure yet if Kim actually ended up flying home from Nigeria early. However, Kim might have accidentally leaked the future development of their relationship on her Instagram because she posted a series of pictures of her and Usman together, smiling and looking pretty happy. And the caption only says couples interview, which doesn't really give us a lot of info, but these are probably new pictures taken long after the filming of this season ended, and it really looks like their relationship might still be going strong. Another thing is that Usman actually liked Kim's post, and I mean, he probably wouldn't like the post if they were on bad terms. And from the whole argument on the show, it definitely didn't look like their potential breakup would be a friendly one. And Kim's post has a lot of positive comments as well. And people have been complimenting the couple, saying how happy they look together. And Kim has actually been responding to people and sharing all the love. But either way, we won't really know if Kim and Usman's relationship survived the massive fight until later in the show. But what do you guys think? Do you think Kim and Usman are good for each other? Let me know in the comments below. 